I wouldn't do that if I were you. It's very scary here. <laughs> ah, we have a bit of a problem. We have a massive problem. Can you believe that we're alive today? For almost seven days, nine hours, and 113 zombies killed. The chopper event is probably gonna happen very soon. But anyways, we were able to make it to the high rise, and I think our next plan is to make it to that little compound over there. So we're gonna need quite a bit of planks to actually move our way on over, but if we pull it off, that's gonna be freaking massive. Now it is only 6.30, so we have quite a bit of time to uh, disassemble stuff and get our but on over there. It's gonna be a little bit of work, but it's definitely gonna be worth it. Also, I'm taking that for least Lee sign. That's gonna look great in my uh, place. I'm honestly expecting that it's not gonna be easy at all to get over there. And we still have some unsecured places as well, but I am remaining optimistic about this. Now, the way that I'm looking at it, we might actually have to build around this apartment complex, which is something that I'm completely fine with. Yeah, I really don't think we'll be able to use this place for much now that I'm looking at it. Ah, whatever. It's fine. It's fine. The good thing is that we do have a lot of planks back at uh, the other building. So I guess we'll make the first trip and start the process. Now, I kind of am still terrified of like moving around this place. I don't know, I just don't feel safe at all going around that. But again, we make it pretty easily. Let's uh, let's start disassembling some of these seats and we'll see how much each one gives us. Okay, that's actually really good. Three planks for a single set of uh, seats. Yeah, that's not bad at all. Oh, this building here is going to be such a resource hoard for us. I mean, that's 11 planks for a small thing like this. And then you have to look at all of the sets here and times that by 11, which would be a lot of planks. Oh yeah. We'll disassemble until it's like 10 and then we'll head back and take a nice little pit stop. Pit, pit break, pit rest, sleepy time. I'm in mirror. I, I've run out of ways to say sleep, but you, you get the point. <laughs> there we go. Hey, look at that. We've leveled up carpentry as well. That's going to be level six. Oh yeah, Mr. Krabs. Okay, that just opened up so much for us because now we can make sets of stairs, which basically means the entire uh, city is in our hold. Yes, 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 that's good. That's really good. Well, anyways, it's getting pretty late, so I think it's about time we head on back. Pretty good day today, though. All we really need is a sledgehammer and my life will be complete. Though getting a sledgehammer is definitely the hardest part out of it all. The cheese, not so much. We have... Actually, we're running pretty low on cheese. Oh no, uh, whatever. It does not bother me right now. What bothers me is my lack of cool trinkets around this place. The little bits and bobbles here and there definitely help out. And honestly, I think I'm gonna rearrange a shelf to be right here, or even better yet, right here. So we have a little bit of extra room for the posters to be shown because we can't place them on the windows. Okay, good night. And Good day! A cigarette should keep the stress away. And hopefully today will be the day that we actually make it over towards our new potential safe house gun place. That's the dream, anyways. And I'm expecting the chopper to hit very, very, very soon. I would be surprised if it didn't. Because right now there are a lack of zombies in the area. I'm not sure if that's because... Wait, what the hell? Is that an elf? It's not even December! It's July, you freak! We got bigger and better things to do. Oh my, look at that horde of planks just from that alone. Yeah, we'll definitely have enough. We probably already do have enough. Oh, it's gonna be a good day. It is, it is. We own this place now. This is our place. The zombies might have the floor, but I have the high ground. <laughs> all right, I think this is a good amount of planks to get started with, so we'll just be taking them all in sections and going from there. 11 planks each time. It'll take a little bit, you know, going back and forth. But it is oh so going to be worth it. Okay, we've made it to the intersection. I am starting to see the more zombies in the area. But we are making some really damn good progress. One more or two more should be all we need, hopefully. Probably need a little bit more than that. But it is a good start. Yes, yes, very soon this shall be a very, uh, very, very interconnecting area of networks. Anyways, let's take a little bit of a lunch break, eat some cheese, and we'll be right back at it. Yummers. So let's bag them and tag them. Yeah, sir. This time we're carrying actually like around 20 planks with us, which is 
pretty damn good. So maybe, just maybe, we'll have enough here. Oh, we are so close. One more trip, and that place will be ours. Look at that beautiful thing. And uh, zombies are starting to uh, feel a little bit more infested in this area. Nothing too wacky, but if a chopper comes around, it might be a little bit of a problem. This is the longest bridge I've built so far, for sure, though. Oh, yeah, look at the length of this baddie. Woo! Did your mother ever tell you to not run on very <laughs> narrow bridges that could lead to your death in a single instance and end the series? Yeah, my mom didn't teach me that either. All she taught me was, uh, yeah. Oh no, she did teach me one thing. And that's that the IRS can't force you to pay taxes. Remember that, kids? Build sky bridges if you're afraid of the IRS. It works every time. Every freaking time. So, let's hurry up and grab all these beautiful planks. Some more of this whole wood here. And we should have enough to finally finish this chapter. It's gonna be a good feeling once we get over there, that's for sure. And all the while, we try to avoid breaking all of our body parts. Pretty important one as well. <laughs> da, 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 da. All right, I think we've made it. Now, you guys have to remember, we're up on the third story. This is on the second story. So we should... Eh, I should build just one more floor like this way. And then another here, just so we don't like trip over the corner. And I will build a wall frame right here. And hopefully we'll be able to turn this into a frame. Oh no, we can add an escape rope right now. Awesome, I didn't even realize you could do that with just a frame. Okay, that works. Hey, there we go. I knew those sheet ropes would have came in handy. And now all we need to do is hold E and drop ourselves on down here. Oh, freaking righty. Now I will be barricading around this area so it, you know it's a little more safe. But damn, we made it to the pile of creep pancake house and more importantly, after I drop all these planks on the floor that I didn't use, this safe house looking place that I am very curious about. Because it has armored walls and armored doors at the front, so this might be the new base. This, this is probably impenetrable, to be honest. And it has so many connections to other places that I would be insane not to stay here. But most importantly, it has a construction lot which I might be able to get a sledgehammer out of which would be insane. Anyways, I'm very hyped about this. It's locked, of course, but that's nothing that the master key can't handle. The hammer and screwdriver combo, kabooya. We're in. All right, let's see what this place has to offer. Look at that, see? Zombies can't get in. I can look at them. They can't get in after me. Ah, look at you, idiot. Woo, dee -dee 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 -dee. Yeah, nice try. You can keep on banging on that for all you want. Now, what is this place? After we turn on the lights, of course, I. Don't want to be caught out in the dead of night here. It, it looks like a home. Just an armored home? They don't have any food for me, which is pretty sad. They have lights. Nice bed. Yo, I'm kind of digging this place. I mean, it's not like home, but you know, it's pretty nice. I mean, it's run down, dingy, absolutely. Like, it's definitely a crack palace, but this is the safest place, so I don't know. What the hell? They got a whole generator in the back here, or like some type of oil tank thingy. They don't got anything cool though. It's mostly empty. Huh. I think this is a little weird. I guess it's just a set of apartments that were closed down for some odd reason. I mean, still pretty cool find anyways, especially with how hidden away this is. Yeah, that's it. Okay. I, I was kind of hoping for like a cool police armory, but you win some, you lose some. Now there is an armored fence. Over there, barbed wire. That might be the next dig. Well, we can consider this place kind of like a safe house number two, especially with those armored doors up front. Don't have to do anything about taking out the stairs. Matter of fact, something that we can do right now is take these three planks that we got from the door and these five planks here so we can craft ourselves. Oh, we need 18 planks? Sheesh, all right, that's a little, little bit pricey, but we can do that. We have eight right now, so we just need another seven. Yeah, we can go do that real fast. Ah, actually, it's not worth it. I'd much rather bridge to somewhere else than uh, waste my time on that. But where to is the question. I was kind of hoping there would have been like a police station or something cool, you know, but I haven't seen anything like that yet. Honestly, the place that looks cool to me right now is that kind of abandoned place right there. Wait, 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 what is that up there? 
You guys see that, um, that American color storefront? Now, I'm not saying that could be a gun store, but it looks like a gun store. <laughs> I think we head over towards that one next. Yeah, we got the planks. We'll be fine. So we got eight right now, which should get us a pretty sizable distance across. And we thankfully have, you know, this haircut place that we'll be able to traverse as well, just on the roof. So that saves up on planks. Bada bingus. Please don't make me fall. Okay, we're good. And then all we need to do is cut through onto the little rooftop area and uh, we should be chilling. Let's try not to fall on the floor though, because if that happens, I can't, um... No, I'm dead if I fall. Like, even if I survived it, I would be on fire with, like, 20 zombies below me. And, uh, yeah, that's not really the best recipe for life or living. Also, we, we screwed up the, uh, placement on this, so we're gonna have to get one more plank, it seems. That's pretty sad. I don't even know if we'll be able to crawl through it. We might just need to head around as well. Ooh, okay. Those new jump scare sounds are something else. <laughs> ah, ah. Ah, uh, blah. All right, well, we can at least uh, disassemble some of the furniture in this, like, armored place right now. Mostly looking at that double bed and the wardrobe. That should give us exactly what we need to see if uh, it works. Yeah, I'm not going to use this, so we can get rid of this, rid of that, and a rid of that. Holy crap, that's a lot of planks for us. That's 11 plus another 8, which is 19. Nice. That's 19 tiles to go across. Definitely worth it. Also, I just wanted to take note of this uh, graffiti here. Don't trust that fucker Jim. Not sure what Jimmy did, old Jim. No, he's talking about my cockroach, isn't he? Oh, I swear to God, if I find whoever owned this place, I'm going to have a word with them. And by a word, I mean a hammer in their brain. No one talks crap to Jim like that and gets away with it, okay? No one. Absolutely no one. Well, anyways, let's uh, keep her going then. It'll actually be very interesting to see if we... Actually, is it worth it to uh, open this up? Oh, I'm sure we'll be fine. And just in case, we can always add in an extra bit of security, because I don't know about these fences. I really don't. No, nah, that's safe. Can I hop it, though? Okay, I can't hop the fence, it seems. Well, what if I drop all these planks on the floor, maybe? Nope, still can't hop it. Okay, so it looks like we're going around. Yeehaw. Ba, ba, ba. And it doesn't really seem like there's going to be much in here. It just looks like a car garage type deal. So honestly, not missing much at all. We're going to need some more planks for sure to uh, get to where we need to go. But this is definitely setting our good foot forward. If you ask me, I almost tumbled right off that. I'm only going to use times two speed for this one. <laughs> oh, that'd be the worst if I fell right now. Oh, I would never live it down. It would... It would follow me for the rest of my life, the rest of my fickle life, the rest of Bucketman's flimsy, stupid life. <laughs> I might be able to complete it. Let's see. Jolly good fish and chips? That's not a gun store! Son of a bitch! Whatever, I guess that's fine. And you know what? Let's use the rest of the furniture inside that kitchen area. <laughs> so we can get in that new area. We're gonna have to go th without food for just a tiny bit, but it should be well worth it if we can uh, pull this off correctly. Oops, I disassembled the door instead. Okay, I guess that works. Come on now, everyone knows that sleep is for the weak. Planks, though, are eternal. Yeah. Bada bingus, we're ready. That's enough planks to last for an entire four tonight. Not really, but I like to believe. Now, we are actually very tired from this, so I'm hoping that this is just gonna be the final trip because um, quite a bit is starting to stack up now. We can solve one of them with a nice cigarette, but after that, it's, um, it's, it's, it's all up for game, you know? Well, I'm hoping this has some cool stuff in it, because if not, this is going to be a huge expenditure. It actually isn't wasted, because we are making ground, which is very nice. And it's actually really cool to do this challenge, because the smallest exploration trips cost so many supplies that it's really cool to make it anywhere, you know? So, like, I'm not complaining at all that we're going to a freaking fish and chip place. I thought it was an armory! Okay, whatever. We're almost there. <laughs> we made it. All right, we got a lot of planks to go with as well. <gasps> no! Oh no! Oh no! Okay, okay, this just got really bad. It's another one of those fuckers! Crop, 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 crop. Oh no! Oh no! Oh, he fell! He fell! We're good! We're good! We're good! We're good! We're good! We're good! And this idiot! Goodbye! Goodbye! Good day! Okay, we can just bash your brains and that's fine as well. Get some girthy smacks and there we go. Okay. That was a little bit scary, but we did lose them. Now, what the hell is in this place? 
I really don't see anything that is, like, useful at all, remotely. Oh, there's just a lot of zombies! There's just a, there's just a ton of freaking zombies! Oh, no! I wouldn't do that if I were you. It's very scary here. Ah, 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 we have a bit of a problem. We have a massive problem. You don't want to do this, man. You're going to regret this. Oh, okay, okay. They, they all just, they just fall naturally. Huh, okay. So we really don't have to worry about hordes on top of these narrow bridges, as suspected. A little bit scary, but we did it. Hey, yeah. Ah, oh, let's take you out now. Good freaking day. Oh, my God. Gosh, I just wanted to check out one singular thing, and you get like 20 zombies on your back. Well, we can at least drop off all these planks that we have accumulated so far, which is pretty cool. We'll be able to check it out just a tiny bit more, unless... There's there's no way up here, right? Y'all are just... I don't think there's a way up here. I think we're safe. Okay. That's all that I needed to know. I want to check out that place, though. I know we are... Eh. We were very tired, but we also don't have a bed right now, so... I think we just... We just gotta do it. You know, gotta put our best foot forward. I thought I killed you. Stay dead. Thank you. Hola, I have come. Where is the pizza? Is there pizza here for me? Or is it just a brain matter for you? I guess a little bit of both never hurt. Come on, man, I'm starving around here. Just give me a place to sleep. Give me a bowl of beans and I will be good. Whoa, that's a lot of them. <laughs> oh, that's a lot. That's actually a crap ton. Oh, jeez. Okay, okay, okay. Back onto the safety bridge. <laughs> shimmy, 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 shimmy. Shimmy, shimmy. Yes, fall to your death. <laughs> oh, that's a lot of doctors here. It's fine. Most of them are falling. Yes. My plan. It's perfect. They never stood a chance against me. Imagine being this pitiful to be outsmarted by the bucket bandage. Yes, good, good, very good. Very good day to be me. Do you really think you stand a chance against me, bucket bandit? You probably do, and I am- Okay, there's more coming in. But we are actually able to take them out pretty well with our, uh, even while being tired, which is very nice. I attribute that to the fact that we are strong, we are fit, and I am- Okay, wait, there's a way up here, isn't there? I saw you earlier. Is this gonna be a problem now? Huh? Is this gonna be a problem? I like your backpack though, so I will be taking that. Just let me- Come on, buddy. There you go. Big tourist back. We have an old one. I like it big. Big better. Oh gosh, there is a way up here. Well then, uh, That's interesting. Well, uh, honestly, I can't do much else right now. I think I'm gonna head back. And I'm just gonna call this a failed mission. At least down this way. I wanted guns and I got nothing. The only thing I got was severe disappointment. <laughs> well, at the very least, we can head back and go get some sleep. Well deserved sleep, might I add. Now, it is quite the distance out there, but it should be very well worth it. And no matter if there is a breach on that side, it doesn't really affect me all too much. So yeah, pretty good episode. Kind of wish I found something cool, but it was just all red herrings. But we always have tomorrow to look forward to, right? Of course. Anyways, as I head back to my base, if you guys liked this episode, be sure to like, favorite, share, and subscribe for more. I will see you guys in the next episode. Peace out.